You need to tutorial yeah, we are going to be looking at how to install advocate office management system script. So as you can see it is my where yeah, I can proceed my script. The script just cost just fifty dollar. So if you want to purchase this script, just come to code canon site. Then click on Archicad. Then you fill your necessary form. After that, read the script after purchasing it. Then you go to your C panel. This is my C panel. Then next, I go to my file manager to upload the script on my file manager. After that, I go to my domain or my subdomain. But here and in this regard, I'm using a subdomain, which is this. I have already uploaded my zip file. That is the script I bought. Then next, I'm going to extract. Extract. Extract files. Then next, I close it. Now I'm going to open this directory, select all, then next I right click to move them to the root folder, then move files. Next I click on the upper one level. So I have successfully uploaded my script to my file manager. Yes, I'm going to my C panel back to create my database. I click on databases. After creating the database, I scroll down to create the user. I created my database as ABCDEF. Let me say EF user. Create user. After creating my database and my user, then next I click on the button. I'm going to add user to the database. So let me show down. I will make sure I select the database I just click step, which is ABCDEF user. Here is my database. Then I add. Next, I give up the database, then show down to make changes. I click on new changes. Now I have successfully created my database and I have uploaded my script to my file manager. Then next I go to my subdomain. So next, after going to my size, all are in good order. Then I click on next. Then I fill the necessary spaces. Here is localhost. Database name is. Let me go back to my database to copy in my database name. Okay. That is my username. Let me see admin, first name, let me see my last name admin. Let me see my email. I've been at I've been at some. 
Okay, finish. Okay. Congrats, you have successfully installed Azure Kit. Now, what next is don't forget to delete the install directory. So I'll go back to my file manager, manager. Then here, I'm going to delete this. Delete. Let me confirm again. Don't forget to install directory. Yes. So here, then I click on delete. Confirm. So after deleting it, I go back, then go to your login page. So I insert my username and my password. Sign in. We have successfully installed my script. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channels. And if you like this video, please use the link in the description to buy the coffee. Thank you. Bye.